Yes then guys, how are we all doing? My name is Morsi and welcome back to my channel. In this video we are taking a look at my brand new Silver God Squad based around a couple of Silver Star Boys and a brand new Silver Team of the Week. And we are not messing about, I'm not doing any slow revealing player by player. This is the team right here guys, if you want to copy it straight up then get stuck in. But for this we are all about the gameplay. So my thought process around this team is I kind of had a look at the current Silver Stars and the Silver Team of the Weeks that are just available on the market and I kind of wanted to pick three of them and build a squad around them. It made sense to go for Yotta. He came out yesterday, I had so much fun using the card and I honestly thought he was top tier in that cam roll. And he gets a nice strong link into this chap down here, Bolongoli, but I'll go through him uh, in more detail shortly. But the other two lads that stood out to me, brand new silver team of the week. I don't know what it is about this man. I just saw his card and I was like, oh, okay, hold up. We got a beast on our hand. And that beast is Moses Mawa. Six foot one, high medium, right footed, only three star, two star, a little bit lackluster, a bit like uh, Asan Cisse, the Gambian silver team of the week. But just ignore that for now. Okay, 16.25k. And look at these stats. He's absolutely rapid. He's got fantastic physicals to go alongside that. With the finisher chemstar, we got 90 finishing, 85 shot power, 80 attack positioning. The dribbling stats go up to 95 agility. Balance is still a little bit low, being 79, but that should be fine. Same with the reactions. I'm sure that won't affect the card too much. And we get that massive plus 15 on the dribbling boost and the player traits. Finesse shot. Pretty much my favourite trait in FIFA 22. And the last man we're building this team around is Big Randy himself. And I have built this team around these boys. You managed to sneak in a bit of Leyun action. In the 4-5-1, you can kind of fit in a Silver Star on this right-hand side. It could be Leyun or it could be Olsen or any other lad you want to squeeze in there. But we're going for Leyun. I want that reassurance at the back. So he gets in with that strong link to Brizuela. Uh, a little bit inconsistent, but probably the best right mid Mexican strong that we can get here. High, high four star, four star, which is lovely. He's basically pace and decent dribbling stats. Very unreliable in front of goal boys, trust me. But apart from that, he is a fantastic addition to this team. So let's run through the team. We're going to start off with the goalkeeper. We've got an icon in his own right. It is Luka Zidane. I honestly don't know if he's related to Zizou himself. Let me know down below if he is, because I'm pretty certain Zidane had a son who played professional football. I'm not sure if it's this chap. I'm pretty certain his name was Enzo in all fairness. But we've got Lucas Zidane here. This could be any French goalkeeper, but I'm going for this geezer because I had him in my club. Nothing really to shout about. Let's see if he's any good, I guess. But he allows these two boys to get on full chemistry. And now these guys are pure paced demons at the back. Sole I have used before. Six foot four. Okay. Four star weak foot, two star skills. 86 pace. 86 pace and he's six foot four. 87 strength. This guy is a brick wall. He's basically a tank kicking a ball about on a pitch. Injury prone trait. Who really cares about that? But if, if anything, this man's going to be injuring my opponents, not himself. And he gets a strong link into this man, Yanni. Six foot two, two star, four star. Also four star weak foot. Only 65 overall this card. But he also is absolutely rapid for a silver centre back. Decent defending stats. Physicals are definitely better than defending, but at the end of the day, guys, in the silver game mode, pace is really important. So the man getting a strong link into Yota is Boli Bolongoli. Fantastic name, 4K coins purely because he does get that strong link allowing you to get Yota in on full chemistry. But the card itself is really, really solid. He's got great pace, very well rounded across the board, the shooting pass and defending. Physicals there, the stamina is fantastic, dribbling, agility and balance are decent. I'm pretty confident he's going to do a solid job for us. Now the two boys allowing us to get Big Mo up top on full chemistry actually looks solid. And I remember going through the silver database when it first came out. And I'm pretty certain this man was one of the first cards that got official rating. And I was like, okay, he looks pretty decent, you know. I kind of a bookmark him. I note him down, I may get around to trying him out. And we are doing just that in this one, guys. We have got Ulrich, 6 for 2, high, high, 3 star, 3 star. And he looks like a bit of a unit, mate. He's got decent pace. Doesn't offer too much going forward, but nice passing and dribbling stats. Defending, he's solid. Same with the physicals. The stamina, strength, aggression. All 80 plus, which is nice. And look at these traits. Solid player. He's fist bumping the boys and he's the leader. And this man gets a hyperlink into Patrick Berg. Medium high, he is going to be the CDM in this team. And looking at this man's card, he's got the stamina, strength. Pretty much a carbon copy of Sonknes, his, uh, his teammate there. But he's also got the leadership trait. This team, who is it? FK Boda glimpse in Norwegian League, it ain't just like a ton of leaders, a bunch of boys hitting it out, fist bumping all over the place, and he's also got outside the foot shot trait, so 
Let's look at a bit of a hidden gem. A lot of you guys sometimes ask about the bench and the manager in these kind of squad builders. So this is what I'm rocking on the bench. This is some silver stars, some silver team of the week cards. And the manager, I've only gone for French. The league doesn't matter too much. French pretty much gets Enteca onto A chemistry. So custom tactics, same win majority on the silver squad builders. I pretty much keep it balanced across the board. 50-50, I don't tweak this at all. The formation, I'm still rocking the 4-1-2-1-2 narrow. That's where I'm having most of my success. I've got Big Mo and Brizuela as my two strikers. Jota in the pocket. Brizuela, we're going to give him a couple of goes, okay? We're going to see if his shooting is really that bad. We do have some fantastic options off the bench. Saltnez and Enteca up and down the pitch in the midfield. Berg holding the CDM role and the back four stays the same. So let's waste no more time and truly test out these boys. I am so close to getting 100 live foot friendly wins. All right, I'm a little silver sweat. You know me guys, you look at my channel. What what else do you expect, right? So we're going into silver lounge and let's get some Ws. Come on now, 100 chemistry, my man knows ball. That is a stat looking silver squad as well. Sulemana, Randy and Tekka. We got a game on our hands early. I'm really excited to try out Mara as well. I've got super high hopes for the man. Hope he lives up to it. Well done, Jota. Guys, if you've not seen my in-depth player view on Jota, this man is top tier. One of my favourites. Are we on side? Oh, off. But that was a ridiculous finish from the man. And I think my opponent thought I scored the goal. So he's ended up quitting the game. It's a nil-nil. Doesn't quite count as a W. So let's get on to game number two. So up next, what are we against? Okay. So interesting team. The 100 chemistry's there. I'm pretty certain that's Henry, the Oxford United boy. I'm not 100% sure in all fairness. All silver uh, common cards. So we definitely out-teaming this man. Right, we get the free kick. What are we saying? Leyun is our boy, I think. He's moving the keeper a little bit. We're going in the top corner here. He's got a nice little run at this lad. What? What? He hit the post. What is this man's free kicks? Oh, that's a penalty, isn't it? Is that a peno or is that on the edge of the box? It's a penalty, it is our chance. Randy and Tekka, 89 pens here. Let's see if we got ice in the veins. We're just gonna look like we're going to the left, but secretly drag that across. And the keeper saved it with his feet. Somebody please explain how we are not winning this game. 11 shots, three expected goals. We hit the woodwork with a free kick. I just can't score a goal. Oh my days, I can't believe it. I actually can't believe this. What is going on in this game of FIFA? Good shot to go. It's a lovely pick out. There's Wayla in the middle, it's got to be. Yes, finally boys, we get the goal. We pretty much have to walk it in at this stage. But we, <laughs> we draw things level eventually. Go on, Mario, use that pace. I was going to say, he's absolutely annihilated me. It's a straight red. This is our chance, boys. This is it. Leyun on the spot. No nonsense to the left flag. Green time it. Happy days. 2-1. We finally get the lead. Well done, Salty. Go on, my sad. Little give a go. Go on, Marwa. We still yet to get the goal with you, lads. Oh, he's got to be a pace about him. That's got to be. Finally. Big Mo is on the score sheet. He got the offside goal in the first game. Oh, Mo. Unreal effort. In case you're wondering why there's so much space in this game, by the way, guys. My opponent's got three red cards. It is what it is, you know. That's a lovely pick out. Go on, Mo. Use that pace. Little dink there. Oh, that is an incredible finish, boys. It's GG's in the chat. It's 5-1. Let's get on to another game. What are we saying? 82 chemistry. This man needs a bit of Yotta to link up with the Saudi boys. I respect it. Suleiman is in there on his ones. No chem to the chap. Let's make it another W for the big boys. Ah, oh, Jota. Why are you doing this to me, mate? Bezuela? Ooh, okay. Okay. I'll take it. I was shit talking this guy at the start. I'm going to take it back a little bit now. So we end up getting the 1-0 rage quit in the end, guys. Just that Brizuela goal carried us through. That's another W. Let's get on to another game. So who have we got up next? Yes, now. 100 chemistry. A nice little Copa Sudamericana action in there. And of course, Suleiman is just like chuck smack bang in there on no chemistry. So it seems to be every team's kind of theme at the moment. But let's get another W for the boys. Get a couple of goals for Big Mo. So we got a game in our hands. 
The man has bought on pretty much every silver star that has uh, been out to date. So Enteka, Scott Olsen are all on for this guy's team. He's also got that Gamba lad, uh, who's apparently pretty decent. He's like the silver Tevez. So we definitely have a tricky game. Let's see if we can clutch out. Brizuela. Brizuela. This kid is stepping up big time. Little dink. Mawa! He's at the post. Probably could have gone for a bit more power. Went for more placement, unfortunately. But we hit the woodwork. Getting close. Little give and go with Randy here, maybe. Hold it up. Pick him. That's a great pick up. Let's keep going. Use that pace. Drive it home. There's the goal. Mosef Mawa gets the goal. Link up play with Randy and Tekka. They're on it. Big Mosef Mawa. Stepping up when needed the most. Fat popcorn. Come on. Come on, lads. Come on. Thank you. We'll take it. Let's get on to another one. The games keep on coming. Thick and fast. We're not messing about today, guys. And a nice 100 cam too. Little link up play, Brazuela. Look at Moses. He wants to get in on goal. Do it to him. There we go. He's getting more clinical. He needs a little warm up period. Now he's bagging goals for fun. 1 0 up. Bolongoli snipping at the heels. Little give and go here. Jota, use the pace. You're in on goal. The thing with this team, there's so much pace. Jota into Brazuela, into the keeper's hands. Ah, oh, Soleil. Ever solid at the back. Love that. This is the brick wall, this man. Six foot four, he's rapid. One of the best silver centre backs in the game. He's only 70 overall as well. Imagine, hold up, imagine if Soleil gets himself a silver star. So, guys, that is where I'm going to end this squad build out. I hope you enjoyed the gameplay as always. If you did, please drop me a like on the video, leave me a comment, let me know what you think of this team and if there's any players you would change. My overall opinion on the team was top tier. I really enjoyed the cards that I have used in this team. Saltnez, by the way. This man, underrated as ever. I knew he was going to be super, super solid. Bolongoli is a fantastic strong link into Jota if you want to mix up and make a hybrid around them. The two centre-backs. This geezer is ridiculous. As I was saying in some of the gameplay, if he got himself a silver star, a 74 overall silver star, 90 plus pace, the strength max it out, why not? Get him 70 defence across the board. He'll be the best silver centre-back we've ever seen in FIFA. This guy was pretty decent as well. The pace was there and he did feel pretty solid on the ball. Zidane... No issues with the goalkeeper. He did a solid job for us. Leon and Brizuela. I've got to admit to it. Kind of hated on this man in the intro to this uh, little squad builder. But Isaac Brizuela stepped up and scored a fantastic skill goal with us. He scored some great goals throughout the whole uh, uh, little gameplay here. And he is a very, very decent card. And then the last man in this team, Big Moses Mawa. Six goals, five games for the chap. It's a little bit disappointing. I really do wish his skill moves and weak foot were that little bit higher. But overall, a super solid card. His finishing is very, very clinical. He feels quick. He feels strong on the ball. He reminds me of Malapa. If any of you guys remember Malapa, I believe he played for Borussia Mönchengladbach in one of the earlier Fifas. He had a 72 overall silver card. And he was a pacey, stocky, strong finisher. And Malwa is pretty much a carbon copy of that. But another fantastic positive about this card, being fantastic as he is, you also have some great linkability options. As you can see in this 4-5-1, you can swap players out, mix it up, use other silver stars that you enjoy more than these boys. 4-5-1 is definitely my go-to formation for my silver squads at the moment. And Saltnez and Berg are solid, solid boys to get my way in on full chemistry. Anyway, guys, I'll catch you very soon for another video. Until then, take it easy, look after each other, and I'll talk to you later.